welcome back to our channel so for today's video it's another um, cooking video and today i will try to follow this is anderson journey um ahi tuna steak recipe visit her channel and please support her channel by subscribing her all right she has no exact measurement so what i'm going to do is i will just um put uh, one tablespoon of each ingredients that I'm going to show you guys, okay? That is um, how, how I will do it. But if you want to know the exact measurements, you can check her video and you can ask her how much, um, how much um, of the ingredients she used for the ahi tuna steak, okay? You can also use any uh, tuna. Um, what I use is a uh, frozen ahi tuna steak. So now, we are going to start, okay? First, I'm just going to grab uh, brown sugar. You can also use any sugar. But I'm going to use a dark brown sugar. I just want to. Okay, so one tablespoon of that. One tablespoon of brown sugar. Any sugar will do. Or if you don't want to add sugar, that's fine. And then I will grab a vinegar. There you go. One tablespoon of vinegar. And then also soy sauce. I discovered this ahi tuna steak when we went to their house before because she cooked us this ahi tuna steak because it's really easy to cook you don't have to watch it and then I'm using a banana ketchup if you don't have a banana ketchup you can use tomato ketchup but of course according to her uh, video and her recipe she used a banana ketchup and now I'm gonna put in oyster sauce. Okay, there you go. And last but not the least, olive oil. So if you don't have any olive oil, you can use the regular oil, cooking oil. There you go. And just mix this. You can, guys, if you don't have a, a baking dish like this, um, you can marinate it with a normal bowl. That's fine. Or the um, baking pan, you can also use that. And then I have here a minced garlic. It's up to you guys how much garlic you want to put, but I love garlic, so there you go. I don't know how much garlic is that. And of course, don't forget the pepper. We're, we are not going to add salt because we already have here soy sauce and oyster sauce. So I think that's fine. So yeah, that's it. Just stir it guys so that it's combined well. What? All right, and now we can put our tuna in here. our tuna there and then we are going to marinate it for 30 minutes or much better if you can do it overnight you can do it overnight do it overnight there you go there you can marinate it leave it there of course turn it upside down sure the sides are covered with the sauce and everything so guys when we bake this we are not going to transfer this I'm using a baking dish that can hold up to 550 I think Fahrenheit I mean the heat there okay just like that and just let it marinate and let it sit there for like 30 minutes 
30 minutes to 1 hour, okay? And then, I'll show you guys later. Okay, so, here's our marinated tuna. And now, we are going to bake this at 350 degrees Fahrenheit for about 20, uh, 15 to 20 minutes. But I'll be I'll be baking this for like 20 minutes. I already preheated my oven, and we're just gonna put this in and wait. Okay, I'm gonna make rice. Now. All right, see you in a bit, guys. Our ahi tuna is cooked. There you go. So we will just let this cool and. It's eating time. 